I have 10 minutes, I have, well now I have 9 minutes left to record on this, so I gotta make it quick. They really ha don't really have that much to say, but my friend lied to me. Oh well, it wasn't really like a lie, it was more like he wasn't being open, like, all this time I thought he was a duotheistic devil worshiper. You know, duo theistic Satanist. Um, now, as you all know, I dropped the label theistic Satanist. Now I just call myself a devil worshiper, but he calls himself devil worshiper, theistic Satanist, whatever. But, like, I thought he believed in a god, believed in heaven. Like, I thought he believed in God, believed in heaven, believed in the devil and believed in hell but apparently that's not the case well no it's like it was weird it's like it's weird it's like apparently oops, apparently he used to be like that but like he said, well, he said months ago that he, um, he said, like, months ago that he doesn't believe in the Christian God anymore, and I didn't have any issues with that, but for some reason, in my mind, for some reason, when he said he doesn't believe in the Christian God anymore, I still assumed that he still believed in a god of light but went against that god but apparently no like when he said he was done with the christian god that meant also no more duo theism and you know just i don't even know why i'm filming my window i don't, I don't even know why i was filming my window but you know apparently that also meant that he was done with duo theism I lack theory, I think I lack theory of mind or something like that. You know what I mean? I can't believe that when he said he doesn't believe in the Christian God anymore, in my mind, I still thought that he did still believe in a God, but it, it wasn't Christian. It wasn't obviously the Christian one, if that makes any sense. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I literally thought he went from believing in the Christian God existing to him believing in a vague God existing, but apparently that's not the case, and I think I lack theory of mind for that, because, like, you, you, all, you all know with me, it's like, like, with me, I don't believe in the Christian God. I believe in um, the Zoroastrian God. Um, I'm open-minded to there being a vague God, but in a, in a general sense, honestly, in a general sense, I will always believe in a God of light. Whether it's the Zoroastrian one, the Christian one, the Jewish one, I will always believe in a God of light and a God of dark. Uh, I will always believe in a god of light, and I will always believe in a devil of darkness. And um, apparently, I know re I know I'm repeating myself, but you know I have uh, um, obsessive tendencies. I don't have OCD, but I have a, I don't want to get you know I don't want to get off topic. But yeah, when he gave up believing in the Christian God, I translated that into. Oh, he still believes in a god. No. As soon as he gave up the Christian god beliefs, he just believed in the devil. Like, he literally, like... Because a lot of theistic Satanists are like that. A lot of theistic Satanists just believe in the devil. And just believe in one afterlife called hell, usually. I mean, well, that's kind of... The whole afterlife thing is a huge debate. But 
a lot of theistic Satanists believe in just the devil. Or if they believe in other beings, they believe that the devil is the main guy, you know, like the creator. Or if he's not the creator, he's still the main guy. And with me, it's not like that. With me, it's like... Because my friend was like... Like, he told me today, he was like... He said to me that... He mostly believes in the devil, and he mostly believes in hell. But he's like... Agnostic to God and, and uh, heaven. With me, it's like the reverse. With me, it's like... I'm more open to there being a God, and I'm more open to there being a heaven, but I really don't know if there's a... Even though I'm a devil worshiper, I don't really know if the devil's, like... Like, I believe the devil's real, but, you know, I believe that... I don't know. Um, I don't even know, it's like... It's hard to describe, like, I wouldn't say I have more faith in God, but, like, <laughs> I'm more convinced that God and, and heaven are real. Um, well, I did have a fucked up dream that came true, that video that I made. I don't want to say what the prediction was, but I had a really fucked up prediction, and it came true, so I guess the devil exists. <laughs> And I once did a ritual to Lilith, and like a week later, I had a special kind of dream, if you know what I mean. And it's been a while since I had a special kind of dream, if you know what I mean. I don't want to get into that, but it's it's been years since I had, you know, happy time dreams, if you know what I mean. It's been years. And then, like... Like, if you don't know if I'm... To I don't want to get off topic with that, but basically, like, I did a ritual to Lilith once, and then, like, a week later, I had a special dream. And Lilith is known for being the queen of the night, and, you know, I don't want to get into all that. But, yeah, it's just... My friend lied to me. Well, maybe the word lying isn't the right word. I wouldn't say he, I wouldn't say he lied to me. He just wasn't being clear. He wasn't being clear on his beliefs. Again, when he said he stopped believing in the Christian God, I translated that in my mind to he still believes in a God of light out there, he just doesn't follow the God of light, but apparently no, he became a theistic Satanist who only believes in Satan and hell, and just, I got mad at him because I was like, you didn't tell me this. I got mad at him for two reasons. One, that he didn't tell me. And two, that he didn't believe in what I believed in. Which is kind of fucked up. I mean, you should, you know, you should accept people's differences and beliefs. But I, I was mad. I wanted him to become, like, I, I think I'm becoming, I think I'm becoming a, I think I'm becoming a cult leader because I want people to practice my version of devil worship, but no one's interested. I mean, it's my version of devil worship. I don't want to get off topic with that, but yeah, it's just, well, it's, it's technically my version of devil worship, but it's also, um, thanks to, um, Adam Daniels. I think that's what his name is. Like, he created the religion, but I created my own subtype of it, unconventional. It's an unconventional, I don't even know, I, don't, I got one more minute on this camera. To get to the main point of the video, I'm sick of being the only duo theistic devil worshiper. Um, to add more to this video, to stay on topic, I'm sick. That's why I had to leave theistic Satanism, because no one in theistic Satanism is duo-theistic. Um, yeah, uh, theistic Satanism doesn't fit me. I don't worship the Christian Satan. Um, wouldn't it be, like, I respect all the theistic Satanists, but I will never understand why, like... Might as well just fucking charge this fucking bullshit. 
while I'm at it, because I, I don't want this video to be derailed. I don't want this video to be derailed. I don't want it to have one title and I'm going off on these fucking re stupid tangents. So let me just stick to the main point of the video. I'm sick of being the only duotheistic devil worshiper out there. Well, technically it's Satanist. I do want to make a video on the difference between theistic Satanism and devil worship. Well, it's similar, but I don't even want to get on top. Because people are like, what? You think it's different? You think it's a different thing? I'll explain it in another video if I ever make that video. It's the same, but it's not. The, I don't even want to get into all that. But I don't want to call it. I'm not a duotheistic Satanist anymore. I'm a duotheistic devil worshiper, and I'm sick of being the only one. I'm getting. I wouldn't say I don't. I don't identify as having depression. People be like, you don't identify as having depression. You just have it. Well, even if I do have it, I don't. I, I, I don't know what the fuck I feel. My moods are temporary, so obviously I don't have major depressive disorder. I used to, I don't want to get off topic with that, but basically, like, no one believes in what I believe in. My religion is so rare that it's not even recognized, you know what I mean? And it's like, maybe that's why the psychiatrists want to label me mentally ill, because I practice something so rare that it doesn't really exist. Well, technically, it exists. Like, it exists within me, but not really within other people. Well, there's the, tr there's the Church of Ariman, but, you know... That's the closest belief system that I can relate to, but obviously the shit that they do is... I wouldn't say it's way different from what I do, but it's a, a little bit different. Like, they do Tantra or Tantra. I don't even know, I don't even exactly know what that is. And they, <laughs> they believe in the chakras. I don't believe in the chakras. Or, like, I'm, I'm aware of... No. I'm open-minded to the possibility of chakras uh, being, like real but even if they are real i don't focus like that's not part of my religion i don't i don't focus on it i don't think i don't even think about it honestly i don't even know i mean cathedral of the black goat also is similar to my beliefs but the christian based though i don't believe in the antichrist anymore i used to when i was because I used to be a reverse Christian. I did meet a reverse Christian on YouTube. They commented. When I say I'm sick of being the only duo theist... When I say I'm sick of being the only duo theistic devil worshiper... Like... I'm, a, I'm aware that technically there are... Duo theistic devil worshippers out there. Like, I'm aware that tech, like, because I used to know one on Facebook. So, and I, and, and one commented on my YouTube. So, obviously, they exist. It's not just me, but it's like, it's so fucking rare. It's rarer than theistic Satanism. Theistic Satanism is, theistic Satanism slash devil worship slash whatever the fuck you want to call it is rare. It's in, it, in itself, but, um, Reverse Christianity is rare. Reverse Zoroastrianism is really, really rare. Um, you know. Duo theistic devil worship in some other way, like in a vague way that's not based off of anything, would be like really, 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 really rare. Um, I guess my friend fits in the really, 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 really rare category. So my friend might actually be more rare than me. Um, but, yeah. Um, um, but maybe not. Maybe I am the rare. Considering how he gave up on the God aspect. I will never give up on that duo theater. Like, you gotta look around. Look at how I... I was even filming outside today. Um... And I was looking at the, even though I do, I'm not a big fan of God, you know, I don't follow God. Me and God are not on good terms, if you know what I mean. I look at the trees, and I'm just like, if God made this, this is so fucking beautiful. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I'll never go to God. I'll never worship God. Sorry, God, but, you know, I'm not, I don't want to, you know, I just, I, you know, I, I'm not interested in you. 
um, if you're interested in me, that's fine. But like, you know, it's just like if God made this stuff, you know, it's it's beautiful. But I have to follow the devil, you know. I have to follow the devil, you know. I, it's it's an it's an this is in an angle because I'm re, I'm recording with the camera charged. Maybe it's good that it looks all angled, so it looks all like fucked up looking. But I have to follow the devil. Um, maybe I am becoming like a sociopath or something. Cause. My thoughts are getting, like, so crazy with darkness. Like, I'm not a bad person. But just my thoughts in darkness. And I have loneliness. Well, not really loneliness. Like, I don't mind being alone. That's a whole other video topic idea. I get a lot of... I've been getting a lot of confusion. And that's apparently... Confusion is, is apparently... A symptom of Ariman. Um, but yeah, um, I'm just. I'm sick of being like. Christians are lucky. You know, all these religions, they're, they're lucky, you know. They, they, you know, Levain Satanists, atheistic Satanists, you know. Which is kind of basically the same thing, kind of. I mean, I don't want to get into that. I mean, there's some atheistic Satanists that don't follow LeVay. I don't want to get into that. Theistic Satanists, just... They are all recognized. They believe in the same stuff. Well, theistic, Satan theistic Satanism is probably a bad example because everyone seems to believe in their own thing, kind of. I mean, there is some groups that have dogma, um, ironically, in theistic Satanism. But you know, just let's 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 stick let's stick to the more strict religions. Like Christianity has to be like one way. You know, every religion that is strict, like you have to follow it this way. So that excludes theistic Satanism. That excludes paganism. Just any religion. That has to be like strict, you know, being a Catholic, Christian, Muslim, Jewish, you know, the lucky, the like the lucky, because they have like the group all thinks the same, and I wish I could be, even though I love being an individual, it gets really fucking lonely, dude, and. When you have a friend that you can relate to the most and then you find out an aspect of him was basically like a lie or an unintentional lie that just fucking hurts you in the dark, you know? It's like a shot in the dark, you know? Wouldn't even expect it, you know? It fucking sucks, you know? But... I'm sick of being alone. I had to distance myself from one guy I knew. I haven't even... I don't even want to say his name. I think he's... I, I don't want this to be about him. Because I don't, I don't want him to get mad at me. But... Um, so I'm not going to... I don't want to be... I don't want this video to become a him thing. But... There was another guy... That, that he's... I think he stopped talking... I think he stopped talking to me. It's like been like as I'm recording. I'm recording this in November. I don't know when you're gonna see this, but as I'm recording this, like there was a guy that was like also similar to me, but he was a YouTube person only. Like we only talked on YouTube. It's been literally a month since me and him talked, and I think it's because again I don't hate him. I think if anything he hates me because he he's avoiding me. Um, but we were so 
sim not as similar as my friend like my friend will always be the number one dude who is similar to me but this guy was like kind of like number two similar but he has but this 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 second guy that's not my friend well i always i always considered him an acquaintance but in his eyes he always considered me a friend so maybe I'm a shitty person for considering him an acquaintance. But shitty person me aside, he hasn't talked to me in a month. And I think our differences um, made us split off. I just, to end, to end this video because it's just so fucking long, I'm sick of being the only duo theistic states um, well, I don't, I don't identify as a theistic Satanist anymore, but, but whatever you want to call it, I'm sick of being the only duo theistic Satanist, I'm sick of being the only duo theistic devil worshiper, whatever you want to call it, you know, it would, wouldn't it make sense to believe in a God and a heaven and a devil and a hell, but you reject the light wouldn't that make more sense? Again, I'm not Christian based. I'm Zoroastrian based. Even if, you know, even even though I don't follow reverse Christianity, that makes the most sense for theistic Satanism. Well, Zoroastrianism definitely. Well, actually, no. Zoroastrianism makes the number one most sense. Um, because that's the, that's the religion that started this whole duo theistic uh, God, heaven, devil, hell thing. But reverse Christianity would be the second thing that makes them that that makes sense. I don't know. It's just wouldn't it make sense to be a reverse Christian in theistic Satanism? It's so fucking rare. I don't get it. Like, I respect everyone that's a theistic Satanist. That's not duo theistic, but I just I don't get it. Like. You would think you would, like, read the Satan passages and be like, that's the guy that I want to follow. The Lucifer passage, you know, follow Lucifer, follow Satan. That you would th rebel against um, Jehovah, Yahweh, I don't even know what you want to call him. Wouldn't that make more sense? To go to hell? Guess not. Same thing with the Zoroastrian uh, as the, the Zoroastrian uh, religion, wouldn't it make more sense to follow Arima? Well, that's a little bit more controversial because people could argue that Satan was a good guy and there is a lot of evidence to support that. The Christian Satan, obviously. When it comes to Ahriman, there's not really that much evidence to suggest that he's a good guy. So I guess reverse Christianity would make actually, in other people's eyes, the most sense. In my eyes, not because I have antisocial personality traits. Um, you know, oppositional, defiant, whatever the fuck you want to call me. I don't even know what you want to even call me anymore. The psychiatrist gave up trying to treat me. I don't even want to get derailed into that. But yeah, I just, I'm, I'm going to end this now because this video is too long and my dad's out here not in my room not in my room but in the living room making noise um well he could make noise but i don't want y'all to hear it i'm just gonna end this i'm sick of being alone in my religion spirituality whatever you want to call it i think i'm just gonna always be my own thing i kind of convinced my friend to go back to the duo theistic mindset but Maybe he's just saying that to make me feel better. I don't even know. I don't even fucking care. Even if he changes his mind and he only believes in the devil and he only believes in hell, then, like, or if he even, or if he goes spiritualist or if he goes agnostic or if he, even if he goes Christian, like, I don't even fucking care anymore. I think I'm becoming a narcissist or something or an egocentric or, because I only care about myself now. And, uh, obviously, the devil, Ahriman, Ingram main you. That's all I care about. You know, I don't... Well, I guess I still do care about my friend, but I don't really care about what he believes in anymore. Like, we can talk about sexuality, you know. 
we can talk about sexuality and fictional characters, but like, you know, just fuck it. You know, just forget it. Forget it. Forget me trying to be a cult leader. Obviously, I'm not successful. Because I'm trying to get people to fucking on YouTube to follow my shit and no one's interested. So I guess just walk the loner path. Fine. I'll be the only dual theistic fucking person out there, but I know the truth. Even if, say, even if the devil and hell is fake, I still believe that there's a God and heaven out there. Because of those near-death experience videos. Um, but yeah, I'm probably going to have to edit this video a lot. My dad's fucking making noise. You might not even be able to hear the noise anyways, but... I don't even fucking know. I'm just rambling on about fucking bullshit that I can't control. Maybe maybe I, I have become a sociopath. I don't identify as one. I don't manipulate people. Oh, if I try to, it doesn't fucking work. Well, I've manipulated... I don't identify as this fucking... I don't identify... I've convinced people into things, but I don't identify as a sociopath. And I'm not just, I'm not saying that to make myself a sociopath. Because sociopaths are not supposed to admit that they're sociopaths. I'm not playing a reverse. I'm not playing a reversal on people. And I'm not, I'm not, I don't want to get off topic, but I'm, I'm not. When I say I'm not a sociopath, I don't, I don't think that. By me saying that, that makes me one. Because apparently sociopaths are not supposed to admit it. So if I say that I'm not one, that makes me one. That's not why I'm doing it. The reason why I say that I'm not a sociopath is literally I don't believe that I am. I accept that I have dark triad traits. Like I have dark personality traits, but I don't manipulate. Oh, if I do, it's not always successful like it, I have convinced people onto things um and I've built I've built relationships friendships whatever you want to call it and I've just I don't want to get off topic with that but I'm just sick of being the only you know Cathedral of the Black Cathedral of the Black Goat and George of Arimon is like the only two duo theistic groups Again, why isn't there more duo theistic Satanists? It makes more sense. I mean, I could kind of see how the devil is the only being out there, or at least the only higher being out there that could, that possibly created the world. Well, theistic Satanists argue that he's a good guy. Well, if he's the creator, honestly, I don't. Well, what if, what if? Okay, so what if the devil is the creator? But it's like, theistic Satanists keep saying that the devil is like a one hundred percent good. Let me just stop this for a second. Theistic Satan, because uh, if I, the longer I record, it gets this video gets split up. I don't fucking know why my fucking camera does that. I hate that so fucking much. So there might be a part in the video where I'm speaking and it gets cut off, and I hope to God, I hope to the devil that doesn't happen. Cause I, I don't want to get off topic with that, but I don't even know what I was talking about. A lot of theistic no, well yeah a lot, a lot of theistic Satanists believe that the devil is like 100% a good guy. Okay, so if the devil created like. The world, or if not everything, wouldn't that mean that he's a yin and yang god? Like, wouldn't that mean that he's just like everyone else that has a balance, or well, a somewhat balance? Because <laughs> some of it, because some humans have more bad than good, and more good than bad, and some people are like literally like neutral somehow. I don't fucking know how people could be like that, but some people are like half and half, literally. What if the devil's like that, you know? But yeah, I'm just going to probably end this soon. This is Gnostic Mind Train, and... But yeah, this is Gnostic Mind Train, and this is the end of this video. Sick of being alone.